What is up and is going on guys, my name is Simsy and welcome back to another FIFA 15 player career. Now guys, I feel like I don't address this enough, um, I just want to thank you guys for the, all the amount of support you've been giving me on all my videos. Uh, 2015 has had a tremendous start and 2014 was just absolutely awesome. So I just want to thank you guys, if you've ever liked, commented, favourites or liked one of my videos, you've subscribed to my channel. Or you've just put supporting uh, comments in the comment section down below. You guys are absolutely absolutely fantastic. And I wouldn't be where I am as a YouTuber without your support. Now guys, in today's episode we have two matches. The first of which is an away match against Swansea in the Premier League. And then later on the match we have a home match against Hull City. I don't know why I laughed at that, but it's a home match. Um, guys, man oh man, if you haven't gone and seen the last episode, I highly recommend you do. I scored the goal of the season, probably for Chelsea. It was... um. It was in the Champions League in the group stages against Salzburg. We ended up winning 3-0 in that match. I scored two goals, got man, uh, man of the match, and Eden Hazard scored the other. Now, from the corner kick, um, they whipped it in, and I ran out to, like, I don't know, I, 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 pushed for, I pushed away from the pack. I jumped in the air. I kind of, like, scissor kicked it and uh, went into the back, and then it was absolutely crazy. Later on in that episode, we ended up winning 4-0 over Liverpool. Scherler ended up picking up two goals. Oscar picked up one. And I picked up man of the match with one goal as well. I missed an absolute howler here in front of Swansea. I really should have put this one at the back of the net. But I did get another chance just before halftime pretty early on with the cutback. Gave me so much space. And I was able to blitz away from the Swansea uh, defense. And to make it 2-0, just that another one goal cushion to go into halftime is absolutely superb. But once that cutback came in, there was no way. They pushed a lot of players forward as well after that one goal trying to get back the equalizer. And uh, it was just not to be. But Dyer on the ball manages to pass it into a pretty dangerous position. We're trying to hold it from their defense there. Taylor, once again, back on the ball. They do manage to whip it in. They get up on the header. And uh, they do manage to actually get a shot off. And I'm surprised that Sigurdsson, the Tottenham Hotspur player on loan, didn't manage to score there. But a nice little tap on there managed to me to break away. And then there was a slide tackle. I did get my left foot shot off there. With the, with the finesse, and I actually managed to miss, which is unfortunate. But we end up winning 2-0 against, uh, against Swansea. At least I picked up a goal in that match. So we do have a simulation match against Portsmouth here. Um, I'm not really too sure what this is in. Ah, the Capital One Cup. I was going to say, I, was like, I didn't think they'd get promoted, but this is Season 2, so they might have... Ah, oh, no, it's impossible, actually, because I can't remember what they're in. But regardless, we end up losing the Capital One Cup match 2-1 because I wasn't playing. <laughs> now, we have a home match here against Hull City. And uh, we're currently in 82 overall, by the way, as well. We're currently leading the table. Uh, second is Spurs, followed by West Brom at third. Newcastle at fourth and Arsenal at fifth. So Liverpool, Manchester United and all Manchester City aren't in, the top, aren't in the top five, which I find is quite surprising. But we have a home match here against Swansea. And it looks like Jose Mourinho is going with the stock standard team, playing, putting Oscar just behind me. They're being, I swear, like, Cesc Fabregas played a lot more at the start of the season. And um, now he's, he's playing Oscar a little bit more. Hull City are currently 20th. They're going to be battling for relegation this season, so it's going to be quite hard for them. Sherlock from the corner kick manages to find me. And uh, Robertson there managed to get it clear, luckily, <laughs> for him. I'm on the ball here trying to create something. I do manage to find Ramirez. And uh, I actually went all the way. I have no idea if it showed this. Because um, you can kind of tell from this clip. Look how many whole City are playing at the back. I can see at least seven players there. Like, for some reason, for during this match, I couldn't seem to break down the defense. I was trying to find Ramirez there, but they shut him down with quite quick succession. So I went with a pretty audacious shot from outside the box, and the finesse actually managed to to prevail. Now, speaking of stuff that nearly prevailed, I did get set through there, one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. But uh, like I said, look at look how many players whole city are just... How many defenders they're sitting back here. And I'm trying to beat the play here. We're just going with some cutbacks, trying to get on my right side. Um, and I do go to the left-hand side, but it's like those goals. You don't score cutback goals anymore that well. Uh, no, no, it's not so much the cutback. It's like the curve back into the net. But, uh, my God, Mikel here probably scores his best goal of the season. He does, like, a, a specky, if you guys know Australian, uh, know Australian rules football. Um, that's basically what Mikel did there. The Nigerian absolutely climbed to the occasion. That is a perfect uh, example of it. And uh, I don't know who was in the net there, but it was just a, a fraction short. Abel Hernandez, the... Um, I don't know what nationality he is. I think he's Argentinian, isn't he? 
or he's Uruguayan. I think he's Uruguayan, actually. But the former Italian man uh, gets his shot off. I do manage to make it 3-0 against Chelsea, and I really hate this celebration. I don't mean to do it. It's with the controller. You get the left analog stick, and you push it up. I usually do that to put your hand. They put their hands up to the, to the sky, like, thank God. Messi does it, and so does Ronaldo. And I, for some reason, I have some gay, like, little twirl for my pro. But two goals here. We do manage to pick up the man of the match as well. And if you look at the top right, we actually unlocked long hairstyle. So I thought I might give myself a new trim. And uh, I was just curious to actually see uh, what type of hairstyles we have. And I decided to go with a, a long, uh, with, a, with a small headband, I think I went with. No, I went with a lot. I went with this. So it kind of reminds me of Fernando Torres. I don't know. But um, I'm going to be going with a long hairstyle with the headband. Uh, I'm currently the second top goal scorer in the Premier League, followed by uh, Adebayo and uh, Sergio Aguero is currently in the top goal scorer on six. So if I could win player of the season or top goal scorer, I would be absolutely over the moon. Um, we do have the squad report. We actually have my rivals as well. Um, I'll show you what I mean in a second. But... Um, you most welcome pause and have a look at the stats at any point in time. In eight games, I've scored 10 goals and two assists. I'm currently worth 20 million, which is absolutely crazy. Um, a couple of the other players, Matic has gone up a bit. Uh, unfortunately, Eden Hazard has gone down a plus one, and he's lost a lot of stats. I have no idea why that is, to be quite honest. And uh, obviously... Uh, Remy hasn't broken into the first team. Fernando Torres has gone back out on loan. So if you look here, I'm actually in first position in the rank, and my dog is going ballistic, so I do apologize. We're about to finish the episode, so there's no point. But uh, here's my rivals. If you click on the right trigger, um, it shows you your rivals. So second is Diego Costa, Remy, Drogba, and then like Brown and whatnot. But guys, I am going to end the episode here. Thank you very much for watching if you've watched all the way through. I really do appreciate it. Remember to leave a like to support this series and my channel. And above all, remember to go out and have a fantastic rest of your day. Thanks a bunch, guys. My name is Simsy. Goodbye.